dailyblog.co.nz radio review. This week, national radio. To what extent is national radio truly representative of the nation? And to what extent is it uh, devoted to the narrow interests of the Pakia elite in Wellington and their fascination uh, with foreign accents and uh, material? Let's find out, shall we? That was hard, wasn't it? Uh, well done, 0259, the last one of the hour. Oh, good on you, was playing the xylophone. He's a big friendly dog, isn't he? Jimora. Radio New Zealand News at 2, good afternoon. I'm Wayne Mowat. Wayne Mowat. Prime Minister John Key says he's making good progress and lobbying other countries' leaders to back New Zealand's campaign for a seat on the United Begging, Nations Security Council. Begging other leaders. Mr. Key's been using Pleading with access them. to more than 50 other leaders at the Nuclear oh Security Council. Oh, God. Summit, being to make a at a nuclear conference and you're being doorstopped by this term. little prick he says he's been with his business card. Oh, I want to and sell you some milk. Last time, particularly the Rwanda issue was there. We're a small country. We Rwanda, mate. You made that. Um, ma- the, the New Zealand government like, was the chairing the Security the Council the when that went down. They permitted that to happen. Mr. Key, actually, New Zealand was responsible for that Rwanda massacre. You moron. A virologist oh. says several outbreaks of swine flu this year are very unusual, and he's not seen anything like Speaking of swine flu. Ah, Professor Robin Grimes. Um, Grimes. has been accused by many of you of being a shocking apologist for the nuclear industry. In fact, many of you became quite incoherent with rage. William did not, however, he says, saying that it takes fossil fuel-generated energy to build wind turbines misses the point. Granted... All the energy to build the first wind turbines came from the burning of fossil fuel, but now that we have, say, 5% of our energy from renewables, renewables, oh, only 95% for fuck's sakes. energy to build wind turbines. Don't even read fuel. it. And when we have a cheap Hurry tax up. renewables in the mix, 90% of the energy to build wind turbines mm, and for that matter, mean, solar panels, and bitch. any other renewable energy equipment will come from fossil fuel and so forth. And the sooner we get started, the better. And David says... David. Thank you for allowing this subject matter to be aired on your program. However, is being anti any form of a logical and non-emotive discussion a part of the Radio New Zealand contractual obligation? Being wanky, you mean. Or is it simply just another Kiwiism? What are you talking about? What exactly was I anti, David? Why don't you tell me when you're feeling more logical and non-emotive? Why read out... We'll be talking to Damien Dempsey in a minute. He sounds like this. So-called non-logical, emotive stuff. Jesus. And then reading out an excuse to put someone down. A man down, obviously, right? So she could have another discussion, another woman talking to another woman about, oh, I don't know, writing. Writing in theories, theories in writing, and novels and made-up stuff, and blah, blah, blah. 